Okay, what part of Proto must never go home to Mole Mount did you not understand? Huh? Mole up, Pronto. We have more urgent matters to attend to. <laughs> Don't move, someone's gonna get hurt. Molinoids of Mole Mount, for your safety, please take cover and leave El Diablo's Nacho to the Shane Gang. <laughs> Why aren't the Molinoids concerned for their safety? Pronto is not like other Molinoids. They see what they want to see. And there's only one of us in danger here. Me! You can't outrun your past, Pronto. <laughs> But whatever you did here couldn't have been that bad. It's a king! Hail, the King Pronto! Pronto is their king? <laughs> Pronto's their king? No wonder he refers to himself in the third person. And has delusions of grandeur. Uh, guys? <laughs> Did the underground say why Black sent Nacho to Mole Mound? Nope. What are Molinoids known for? Weak eyes. Blocked pores. Largest collection of maps in Slugterra. Pasty complexions? Oh, wait, that last one. <laughs> <laughs> Score another win for the Shane Gang. Huh? Nacho's gone. But he was kicking our butts. Why'd he run? Because he's smart enough to know he wouldn't get another lucky shot in. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, oh, thank you. Uh, <laughs> uh, he'll be impossible to live with now. Uh, at least His Majesty doesn't refer to himself with the royal we. Don't give him any ideas. Surely you jazz. Pronto would never put on airs. As heir to the Mole Mound throne, you must take it. Huh? Hmm. Guys, Nacho left a trail we could follow all the way across Slugterra. But that is not the way out of Mole Mound. That is the path to wisdom. Which leads to the Vault of Knowledge? Ugh. The repository of all Molinoid information, including the map Mundi, the famed Molinoid map of everything. Everything? Every cavern, tunnel, bridge, shortcut, and hidey hole in Slag Terra. That's gotta be what Dr. Black sent Nacho here to find. If I'm right about Black being in league with the Dark Bane, that map could give him other routes to the deep caverns. We can't allow that. A lucky thing King Pronto could order his whole army after Nacho. No, the Molinoid King does not command armies. He serves his people paw and foot 25 7. Eight years backlog, and those toilets ain't gonna plant themselves. <laughs> Pronto is not amused. Listen, not to worry, folks. The Shane Gang will take on Nacho and save your Mape Mundi. <gasps> oh. Pronto, you can sort this King stuff out later. But Nacho has a big head start and we need to move. That life is over now, Your Highness. Now that you have finally returned to us, you must face up to your obligations. Oh, well, there you go. That's it, you see. I'm booked solid. Wall-to-wall -wall adventures right through the middle of the next decade. So here you go. There's that. And if I'm going to find Nacho and save your map, I need my talented tracker. Yes. Oh, <laughs> Sire, you 
may draw your friends a map to the map. <sighs> here, in this cavern that is set under an axe. We are here, it is there. <sighs> We're playing catch up. Ignorance is bliss. Molinoid motto. Well, our bliss requires Black's ignorance. After you. This can't be right. Well, he did just scribble that thing together in three seconds. Seriously? If this is the path to wisdom, no wonder the Molinoids prefer ignorance. We could have really used Pronto to get through this maze. Sorry, but today is random complaints day. Come back tomorrow for wardrobe malfunctions. <sighs> is this Pronto's destiny to spend my days ruling over the most boring matters in all of Slugterra? And your evenings repairing everything that needs fixing around here. Oh, I don't want to be king! You will not have to worry about that for long. No trace of Nacho. Must be pretty far ahead. We need to pick up the pace. How's Nacho know where to go? We have Pronto's map. What does Nacho have? Ask him! <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were goners. Must be dumb luck we got away. Uh, any guesses? Maps always have a riddle or a cleverly hidden clue to point the way in cases like this. Now let me see, how would Pronto think? Found it! <gasps> It says 100 right on the pack, but I only count 98. Yeah, well, once I got 92, grab me a river. Next! My co-worker looked at me funny. There! <laughs> She's doing it again! <sighs> I now pronounce your man and wife. Next! My faucet's been dripping for the last 2,927 days, and you have to fix it, your majesty. Six on the dot, don't be late, and don't track in dirt like the last king. Which reminds me, bring a mop. What is wrong with us? Don't we Molinoids know how to do anything? My liege, they are not used to thinking for themselves. That's always been the king's job. Ignorance is bliss, right? <laughs> but I don't have to tell you that. Unless you think I should. I mean, you are the king. What do you think I should do? <laughs> We're supposed to keep climbing. Yeah, well, we ain't climbing that. You're right. We're gonna have to float up. <laughs> It's Nacho! <laughs> <laughs> Nacho's going the wrong way! Maybe he knows a shortcut? Yeah, maybe we should follow Nacho. No. <laughs> Sealed. We're here first. Huh. I was expecting it to be, uh, you know, grander. Now how do we get in? The doors are covered in smolten. Remember this guy? Your forge smelter. Perfect. <laughs> Well, dig in. <sighs> you see, she says potato, and I say potato. That's it! I'm calling this whole thing off! 
I quit! But Majesty, the law is very clear. His Majesty can quit, but first he must find a volunteer to take his place. Oh, but no one is foolish enough to volunteer for this! If it is foolish to desire a life of service to one's people, call me a fool. But I volunteer! Zido, my life, Lord Nemosis! It is my honor to pick up the Mole King mantle and hereby lay claim to the kingship. <laughs> I quit! <laughs> and you are? You know full well that I am Pronto, the mole who humiliated you in the slag run. Humiliated? This does not ring a bell. Uh, oh, okay. Maybe this would clear the wax from your ears. Pronto, former heir to the Molmount throne, and now your king! Ah, yes. You wear the crown of the king. A little big for you, no? We think perhaps it would fit us better. The royal we? No! How dare you presume to be like Pronto? We, uh, uh us! Then we challenge you for the kingdom. Oh. He can do that? <laughs> it is all very legal, I assure you. Indeed, the challenge must be met, or Sido, unopposed, shall become our new king. Ooh. Then, His Highness accepts your challenge. Slaps at five paces. And may the best mole win. Not if Pronto has his way. His Majesty was challenged, and so has first pick. I would go for the shiny one. So perhaps this is what you wish me to do. Therefore, I should choose the other. But you are a crafty opponent. And you know Proto is smart and would think many moves ahead. <laughs> and so you must really want me to choose the shiny one. How do you? You think you can outwit your king by making him doubt himself. But it is I who have outwitted you, my wily nemesis. You choose first. Don't ask me why, but I honestly thought you'd go for the other one. Five paces. Turn and duel. One, two, three, four, five. <gasps> hmm. Find something? Not the map. Something else. Can we hurry up before Nacho realizes his mistake? Yeah, he's already here. Thanks for leading the way. Us? You were a step ahead the whole time. No, he wasn't. He tailed us. It was an elaborate fake out, and we fell for it. Now, hand over the map. Don't have it. But if you want to help us search, we could use the extra hands. I prefer to work alone. Guys, grab onto something! <laughs> Yo, -ho! King, watch your face. Come out and face me like a mole. Oh, get in! Ha! I shall smite you with my kingly might. <laughs> What's it?
Surrender, scoundrel! Sido does not know the meaning of the word. Then as king, I shall work to improve the schools. <laughs> <laughs> want with it. <laughs> this slug has caused me a lot of trouble. Hand me the map or it's paste. <laughs> <laughs> Stop! Take it. But whatever Black has planned, he won't get away with it. Eli, don't! Sorry, Trix. It's the only way. <laughs> <laughs> Buzzsaw, help them out. Guys, this place is coming down. <laughs> <laughs> You would not blast an anamore. Say my name or smell the consequences. Your name, little mole, is Toast. <laughs> you remind me of someone. A nosy little mole whose interference put me in the red with black. Uh, yes, and that was me! Hmm, I think not. A mole that stands in my way would be much more imposing. <laughs> That's it! I quit! But of course you do. Sum total of Molinoid history. Yeah, that can't be good. Plus, Nacho got the map. Actually, he's not the only one who knows how to pull a bait and switch. <laughs> uh, confidentially, I hope your friends beat Nacho to the map Bemundi. Then it will be my pleasure and not that brutish fellow's to hand the map over to Dr. Black. Dr. Black? Yes. My benefactor has given me a second chance to be his second chance. And with Dr. Black's backing, this king won't be clearing drains and settling petty squabbles for the little moles. That tears it! I and Quinn! Ah. No take backs! Aha! But I had my fingers crossed when I said I quit! Ah. It does not count. Ah. The finger cross, double cross. Curse that Molinoid rule. He attacked our royal personage. Justice demands that we whack this mole. The royal we? <laughs> Folks, really sorry, but your people's history is... History. Oh, no. Ah, yes! <laughs> uh. Somewhat indirect smiting, Your Majesty. Yes, another senseless victim of secondhand smoke. Oh no. Eli? The Mappe Mundi, Your Majesty. It holds dangerous secrets. I urge you to destroy it so Dr. Black can never come after it again. You want me to eliminate the last surviving fragment of Molinoid history? Can I do that? Actually, you can. 
The missing chapter of the Book of Mole Mound. It's been lost for ages. Uh, what the hey? Ignorance is bliss, right? Burpee? So, uh, what does the new chapter say about the king going on adventures with his friends, maybe? It says that if the king is absent or unable to perform his duties as required, he must appoint a proxy. Aha! Then I the be Sido, keeper of the keys, <laughs> royal stopper of leaks, and decider of all things squabbly and petty. Of course, questions of Mallmount policy will remain with the king. Me. You... 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 Majesty will do, although I would have accepted my liege and or your highness. Nacho really played us. Too predictable. So we'll change up our game. That's not what bothers me. The Mape Mundi didn't just point the way to the deep caverns. It marked the location of the drop. What if Black doesn't want to go deeper? What if he's searching for a way to the surface? Yeah, but since the one and only copy of the map is Toast, Black's not going anywhere, right? Hey, if you destroyed the original map, what does Nacho have? <sighs> Help me, Eli! Trixie! Cord! I've been captured! I'm being held at Land's End Cavern! Please help me! I snuck in here to send this message, but then... <gasps> Wait! No! No! Damsel in distress! Pronto's specialty. I thought you said your specialty was power napping. Don't try to label me, sir! Pronto cannot be confined! Land's End? Well, that's way, way out! There's got to be someone out that way that can help her. No handoffs. She asked for us by name. But she didn't ask for Bronto. My heroic reputation makes asking for me by name totally unnecessary. <laughs> I'm guessing this must be the place. Help me, Eli! She must be where she transmitted her message to us. But where is the distressed damsel? Over here. <laughs> But I'm not a damsel, and I am certainly not in distress. Ambush! If you're working for Dr. Black, you must be new. Ah, oh, he's next week's contestant. You are the game today. Game? What game? The one you'll play now that I've brought you here. And you are? Well, isn't it obvious? I am the master of the game. And what's really cool about my game is you don't lose points when you fail. You lose everything. will pass on your invitation. Huh? He's some kind of an image. Like a hologram. <laughs> Did you really think I would make it that easy for you? You're playing against the best brain in the cavern. What a specimen. You should consider it a badge of honor that I chose you as opponents. If you're so great, how come we never heard of you? Because the losers of my games can't talk. <laughs> we're not losing because we're not playing. We're leaving. <laughs> now what are you doing up there? Oh, I must have pushed the wrong button. Sorry about that. Hang on and I'll get you down. <laughs> hmm, now which one is it? 
eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Uh-oh, I seem to have pushed the squisher button. Oh dear, I don't have the override password. Quick, do nothing. I'm going for help. Gotta figure a way out fast, or we're gonna be turned into a shame gang cube. You think? Look like there's anyone around, but I did find a DJ. Yo, yo, yo! MC Mixmaster Game Master in the house! I was thinking of busting out some sweet beats for you hep cats to get fit into! Smooth jazz. I hate smooth jazz! <laughs> what? This is the perfect kind of music to get squished to! <gasps> Make it stop! Trixie, fire Ramstone at the scene. Jules will short out the motor. I don't care about the walls! Someone just make the music stop! <laughs> Jules? Bludgeon! Calling all slugs! Ah! There! <laughs> yeah. uh Ooh, thrilling, wasn't it? And that was only your first challenge. And our last, gamer guy. Just give us back our slugs and we'll call it a draw. I've gone through considerable trouble and expense to match wits with you. I only choose the best contestants, and my research tells me three of you are. Hmm? I didn't bother researching the molinoid. Ah, oh, yes. Pronto remains a molinoid of mystery. My rules are simple. Any slug you use, I take. Survive my challenges, and you'll see them at the end. Eli, we could lose all our slugs. We're not leaving without Jules and the others. That's the spirit. Now, lady and gents, step right up for your next challenge. <laughs> Pull the lever and win a prize. <laughs> Here we go! Round and round it goes, and where it stops is where you go. <laughs> don't land on freedom, please don't land on freedom. Please don't land on freedom. No! <laughs> that was really, really intense, wasn't it? Let's take a look at what you've won. I don't know what that wacko's game plan is, but we've got to try not using slugs to deal with it. This was a challenge? No, this is! Wait, I think it may be time to seriously rethink this no slug rule. I think you may be right. Okay. Oh, but now you lost Buzzsaw. I hope it was worth it. Oh, it was. For me. Pronto! Oh, goody! Another slug! It'll be a nice addition to my collection. But I can't just take something without giving something back in return. Here, have an apple. Go ahead. It's practically exploding with flavor. <laughs> ah, two bridges, but only one will get you safely across the quicksand pit. Which will it be? Make your choice quick. That bucket of rotten apples is about to tip. We swim across. Because it's quicksand? Precisely. <sighs> he wouldn't expect us to use the worst looking bridge. Or would he? Quick, Eli, make a choice. Oh, bad choice. Oh, jump to the other bridge. 
Maybe he'll come back up. Quicksand is a one-way trip. Down. Game Master! Do you hear me? Pronto better be back with us when we finish this! Hmm. There are consequences for failure. Pronto's challenges are over. Yours are not. Ah! I thought this bridge was better! <laughs> What fun! You should have seen the looks on your faces! Oh, wait! You can! We don't even need slugs to beat your challenges. Have you had enough? Ha! Not even! You'll see! All the machinery seems to be below us. He's gotta be down there somewhere with our slugs. Pronto. His digging skills would sure come in handy now. Yeah, I can practically hear the little mole man now. Hello? Uh -huh. Hey, did you hear that? He's talking to us from the soupy beyond. Oh, from the darkly below, where somebody doesn't understand the concept of a well-lit workplace. But how did you survive the quicksand? Why shouldn't I? Molinoids spend their summers bathing in quicksand. And also, I dug a hole through the bottom of the pit. That makes you our inside operative. Find where the Game Master is controlling all of this and report back. But keep it quiet. He can't know you're down there moling around. Ah, understood. Agent Pronto is on the move, like a ghost. Three contestants still standing. Hmm, you truly are the most impressive I've ever challenged. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> hey. Maybe we're not impressed playing against a lonely crackpot with too much time on his hands. Hmm. I had some other fun games to play, but why don't we just skip ahead to a final challenge? <laughs> and this one is personal. <laughs> <sighs> ah, Eli, our hero to slug and human. Can you save both? If not, who do you choose? I know you two. From the zombie mall. What are you doing here? Well, it wasn't my idea, I can tell you. We should have taken the cruise, Sylvia. You need to get out of your comfort zone, Remember Howard. what the doctor said about my comfort zone? Dr. Schmachter, honestly. Did, you, did we have to really write here, right in public? Trixie, dear sweet Trixie. How about a little target practice, hmm? Five targets, five shots. If you can make them, that is. If you think I'm wasting my slugs on your silly game, forget it. Then allow me to supply the slugs. Though I very much doubt even that will help you. What are you saying? I can't shoot straight? <laughs> we'll see, won't we? <laughs> Lucky shot. Oh, Howard. A thrill ride. Well, Sylvia, you know I don't like these things. Who will it be? Slugs or people? Or does the hero save himself? Cord, the brilliant engineer. You have two minutes to build me something amazing, or your friends will have a nasty surprise. Eli? Can you hear me? Trixie? are extremely well made. Look at the joinery. Sylvia, I don't care about the cat and picking joinery. Something's not right. Okay, Whiff, stink up. You know bacon bits make you windy. Ah, so that's his game. Yeah. All right. 
right. <laughs> what the heck is this thing? This isn't at all what we signed up for. I have eyeballs on the package. And I found the slugs. It looks as if they're connected to the package. It's really creepy. That's why he's stealing them. He's somehow using their energy to power himself and this game. That's it. I figured it out. Yeah. So, Cord, what did you make me? A jetpack. But it ain't for you. Thanks. But you made me miss my target. And that target would have sent Eli into the drink and turned you into paste. Oh, that would be bad. Is that a jetpack? <laughs> Was a jetpack. Standing idle while they drop to their doom? You need to brush up on your strategic thinking. Those two didn't react to the stink. They're more of your robots. And I know you won't harm slugs. You need them for their energy. Oh, yes? What else do you know? That you are just a clever geek living in a basement who's hooked into a slug energy machine to power his fantasy world. How could you know that? Nobody researches me! Why don't you stop playing games with robots and holograms and match wits with me in the real world? Ha! Come and get me! <sighs> Eli! <laughs> I'll even show you the way! We can't all fit! It's another challenge! I'll stay! You two get in! Yeah. Oh, friends till the end. Such noble losers. We're not <gasps> that noble. We just found a better way down. On the Pronto Express! Woo -woo! I should have researched that Molinoid. It's checkout time, Game Master. Hand over our slugs. <laughs> you think I'm beaten? Guess again. You still have one last challenge. To get past me. And with the slug energy I've accumulated, you're not going to exist to play another game. Ever. <laughs> Handsome devil to Top Dog! The package is locked on us! Eli to Pronto! I know! <laughs> Geo Shard! <laughs> this was supposed to be a legitimate competition. <laughs> that extra slug energy really packs a punch. <laughs> But you ruined it with your rule breaking and your cheating. Did not? Then you barge your way into my home and make demands. You'll need more than that to stop me. Uh oh. <laughs> and you, my nosy mole, ah! were the worst offender. Uh, I'll fill in the tunnel. Ah! At ten minutes, tops. <laughs> Pronto. <laughs> <laughs> Go 
Go ahead. Keep slinging. It just makes me stronger. Status? One slug left. Same here. Use the X-Mitter, Eli. That'll stop him cold. It'll stop us, too. And I need blaster power for a different idea. Right, Burpee? <laughs> Fusion move. Yes. Use what you have left for a diversion and make it count. Shame. But you will not live through this! I've started a meltdown that will destroy this entire cavern within minutes! You might have just enough time to capture me, or save the slugs, but not both. Make your choice. He's right. It's gonna blow. Forget about him. Grab the slugs. I think we've got them all. We're out. Now. is still free. Guess we'll have to worry about fake rescue missions from now on. But this wasn't a fake. We rescued them. <laughs> okay, CC. If you were trying to tail me quietly, I gotta say, epic fail, dude. <laughs> Want to have a little fun with them, Burpee? Can't shake them. We're gonna have to persuade them to go away. And we can be real persuasive, right guys? <laughs> A little advice, CC. Next time Black wants me followed, he should send someone yeah. other than you. He already did. <laughs> We've been in tougher scrapes before. Right, Burpee? <laughs> Surrounded. 
Just give us the orders and we'll take him down. Your confidence will be your downfall. He and that Infernus of his are dangerous. Well, you don't have to worry about that. His slug is sick. His slug is sick? Yeah, couldn't even take on a flopper. So, what do you want me to do? Let him go. What? Hit him with a tracking ghoul and let him go. But we've got him! Now's your chance to end this! Do as I order, or it'll be the end of you! Huh. Well, I can't promise you he'll get off without a scratch. Whoa! We've got to get Burpee home and fast! <laughs> Scrap no move on three! One, two, three! <laughs> Oh, no, you don't. Oh, man. That ghoul must have been a dud. We should have been goners. Well, I hope that worked. Good work, lads. Low sodium organic vegetable and wheatgrass smoothies on me. <laughs> Seriously, again? I'll get the ladder. <sighs> okay, I know what you're thinking. But they started you it! Do this, Max Jackson. I wanted to watch Kisses from a Hoverbug, but they insisted on Max Jackson's 2,000 Furious Punches. <laughs> I may have raised my voice a teeny bit, but... <laughs> Just don't give them a right to do this to Pronto! There you are! Something's wrong with Burpee. I don't know what happened. Never seen him like this. I've never seen any slug look like that. Little dudes get a little low on energy sometimes, but I've never seen one sick. Poor little guy. He can't even move. I'll make sure you get better, Burpee. There's got to be something we can do. Well, if there is. No troll, human, or even molinoid Noahs. Couldn't agree on a movie again? But, but I, but, uh, yes. I'm not giving up. Burpee needs our help. You know we're with you, Eli, but none of us have any idea what to do. These guys do. <laughs> Stay with me, pal. We'll be there soon. Wherever there is. Getting darker. And scarier. This old place gives me the heebie-creepies. Ah, it is because we have entered the territory of the Shadow Clan. That's where Burpee needs to go? I'll never fit through that. There's got to be a bigger opening. Yeah, but how do we find it? We ask. This is their territory. I'm betting the Shadow Clan will know what to do. <sighs> Never around when you want them, though, huh? <laughs> Whoever wants them around, they're always so serious and spooky. You know, it's like they enjoy being frightening. Uh, not that Pronto is ever afraid. <laughs> it's okay, Cord. I got this. This crowd is sacred. Leave now. I need your help. This one's fire will go out soon. Once it does, he will be no more. I see now why your slugs led you here. To the light well. The light well? What's that? The light well is 50% legend, 50% lore, and 50% Mystery! Supposedly, it's where slugs go for a recharge. I'll take Burpee, if you show me the way. Paths to the light well are not meant for humans. 
It may not even be possible for you to survive the journey. That's a risk I'm willing to take. One way or another, I'm taking my friend. Right behind you, Eli. Hey, why do I have the impression that Pronto was just insulted? He said only I can go. Eli, no. You can't go in there alone. It's okay. If that's what I've got to do to save Burpee, then that's what I'm gonna do. Besides, I won't be alone. I got these guys. Lead the way. Of course, they get to go! Dr. Black, the tracker's working perfectly. We go this way. <sighs> okay. Let's try this again. Easy, one rock at a time. Okay, buddy, take it down. <laughs> it's armored all over. <laughs> okay, need another idea. Yeah, the double barrel would stop it. Only problem, that takes two hands. It looks like that's the only shot we got. We're almost there. I hope. Still doesn't feel right that Eli's in there by himself. Of course it is not right. How could the Shadow Clan think only Eli is worthy? Pronto the Magnificent is worthy? Very worthy! Bro, that's not what I... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. I think perhaps there has been some mistake. Most likely because you do not know how truly wondrous Pronto the Wanderers truly is. Okay, I understand that. <laughs> oh, that one wasn't me. I got a bad feeling. Yeah, well, hopefully if Pronto annoys them too much, they'll only flay him. No, that's not it. Did you see that? Whoa! What is that smell? Oh, this smells worse than a bunch of... Flatulorinka slugs. <laughs> Slimy. <laughs> Gross. This tunnel smells like the inside of a. This isn't a tunnel. <laughs> If we got spit out its mouth, 
That means we crawled in through it. Gross! There is no way I'm going back in there. Jeller! First thing after we fix up Burpee, we are all taking some very long showers. Eli told us you were bad at being stealthy, CC, but man, you are really bad. I'd save the groaning. You'll be doing plenty when the Shadow Clan are done with you. I'm in position. Now engage the enemy. Let's get him! You're attacking the Shadow Clan? Not even CC's that dumb, is he? Shh. Save the questions. I don't want to miss a minute of this. What's that? You don't like my little dark light? <laughs> Never fear. Pronto the Worthy is here to save the day. It's warm in here. And... Sweet? <laughs> Get out of here! Man, I think packs a punch. Good thing it was just one and not a... Huh? Swarm! You're right. Put him to sleep. <laughs> Sweet. <sighs> the light well. It's. We made it, Burpee. <laughs> we certainly did. Thanks to you. Black! <laughs> what do you want with the light well? What I want is to destroy it. <laughs> <laughs> Get here. I can answer that. <laughs> First of all, the tracking ghoul CC hit you with helped quite a bit. The dud. But you deserve the lion's share of the credit. I don't think I could have gotten here if you hadn't taken care of every obstacle in the way. <laughs> you certainly seemed quite motivated. Uh, Burpee? Burpee! No! <laughs> You'll never make it. <laughs> Looks like you were wrong. I made it. Congratulations. We're getting hammered here! 
We might have a chance if the Shadow Clan would work with us. Ah, to them we are unworthy, completely ignorable. I think this means the Shadow Clan are in. Without the light well, slug energy can't rejuvenate. And without your slugs, my ghouls will rule. Goodbye, light well. No, you don't. It's a trick! Get back here to the dark light! No! Should teach you not to mess with Pronto. We did it. Yeah, uh, we didn't do it. I think they're saying someone else got inside the light well. One more shot will do it. You know, I wanted you to see the light well's destruction, but you. You've changed my mind. What? My ghouls! What just happened? Where did you take him? So close to the light well. Our powers are limited. We could only send him through the shadows elsewhere. I fear those abominations you call ghouls are also what sickened this infernus. Black ghouls made Burpee sick? The energy that binds the slugs to slug Terra is growing weak. Huh? If the ghouling does not cease, the dark pain will come. Well, you can count on us to stop Dr. Black. Thank you for everything. Now is not the time for thanks. The struggle for all of Slug Terra has only just begun. Did they just bow to you? Eli! Ah. How's Burpee? See for yourself? Yes! <laughs> Burpee! <laughs> I don't know what happened out here. You must have done something to impress the Shadow Clan. Ah, it was nothing! It was bound to happen once they got to know Pronto. They were the... <laughs> <sighs> Glad that's over. It isn't. Other slugs are gonna get sick like Burpee if we don't stop Black. This is just the beginning. You know the drill, people. Lock them in, block them. Everyone inside and secure your slugs. Trini, 
time for bed. Aw, oh, Mom, do I have to? Flutter and I want to play some more. Flutter will still be there in the morning. Now come inside. See you in the morning, you crazy little meatheads. <laughs> and don't forget to turn the fence on. about a month back. Just a few random slugs at first, but now this is the worst we've ever seen it. And your healer slugs don't help? We don't have any. Main reason we called you. Heard you had a mighty solid fella named Doc. Well, I did. I'm sorry. But no, he's fine. Just far away. I have to admit, when Trixie said you needed some help, I wasn't expecting this. It's like something sucked the juice right out of them. That would be the creature. Uh, creature? The High Plains Monster. It's something of a local legend. No one's actually seen it, but whatever did this slipped through the force fence like it was nothing. But I've seen it. It's big, and it's scary, and it has long legs like a spider. Don't worry, Trini. Flutter's going to be fine. <clears throat> Could we uh, take them to the light well? Perhaps, but it doesn't explain what's causing this, or if it'll prevent it from happening again. We'll get to the bottom of this, Brody. I promise. If you could just, uh, give us a moment. Okay. I'm all for helping the slugs, but a monster, Eli? I don't know. I'm an engineer. In my mind, if I can't see it or I can't hit it, it don't exist. What do you think, Trixie? You really think it's a monster? Well, I believe Trini saw something. And look at these slugs. Brody isn't the kind of person to exaggerate. If we don't figure this out soon, people could get desperate. Please! Order! Order! What's going on here? Got me. No one told me about a meeting. Order! Order, please! Our decision has been reached! Thank you. Now... It is with full understanding of the desperation of the ranching situation that the town council has voted unanimously to award a bounty. 2,000 gold! <laughs> Everything our treasury has. To the slug slinger who brings in the High Plains monster! Oh, but we don't need bounty hunters. I called in the Shane gang. Hey. And no, no, now they can have a shot at it too. At this point, Brody, we need all the help we can get. This doesn't look good, Eli. Tell me about it. This kind of money, this much desperation, people could get hurt. <laughs> eh. Sorry. <clears throat> Stalker. I'll bag your creature. It'll cost you 5,000 gold, not two. Five thousand. For that, you get my services, a monster, and your peace of mind. <laughs> Mister, if you can get it, we'll find the money. Fire, ice, the power trips. The town council is making a big mistake, Brody. I know these guys. They're bad news. Stalker, especially. Isn't there something you can do? What do you want, Shane? I know you and I have a history, 
But if we're gonna be here, we all need to work together. <sighs> It'll better our chances of catching this thing. Better our chances of splitting the bounty, you mean? We're not doing this for money. We're not? Uh, we're not. These people need help, and they don't need their town destroyed. They don't? <sighs> oh, uh, they don't. Come on, man. Use your head. This thing could be dangerous. <laughs> to slugs. Do I look like a slug to you? I work alone, kid. Cheer up, dude. We'll just have to find the creature first. Check it out. It's a motion detector mod. Anything bigger than a molinoid comes our way, this thing will light up like a phosphoro slug. Good thinking, Cord. Let's get going. Here's a joke, brothers. What do you call a flop of slugs that transforms? Huh. That's weird. What is? Brothers? Brothers? <laughs> Come on. Uh, nothing. I thought I had something and then it was gone. It's the last time I buy an off-brand plaster mod. Brothers? Brothers? The power trips. Come on. <laughs> Guys, I think I found them. Looks like these clowns here got themselves iced. It's just like the slugs. No way, man! This thing is hunting people now? This is not what I signed up for, man! You're making noise. What's wrong? What's wrong is we're three men, uh, two men and a lady down. This is what happens when we don't work together. And your stupid traps aren't catching the creature, they're trapping us. Hi. I'm upside down. Appreciate this, man. I... Quiet. Hey, no, that's just my blaster. Oh, cut me down. Cord? Proximity alert! Something's coming! Something big! Cut me down! Well, how close is it? Really close! Cut me down! <laughs> I can't tell. It's coming from multiple directions. There's more than one! <laughs> Uh, no, no, not anymore. This doesn't make any sense. Wait, 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 wait. I got a new signal. 400 yards out. It's close. 300 yards. Everyone, get ready. 200 yards. It's moving way too fast. What the heck, man? Where is it? I can't see nothing out here. 100 yards. 50 yards. And it's right on top of us. That's what you get for buying off-brand gear. Stalker! Hey, mama! Fire! Look out!
<laughs> Trixie! My expert diagnosis is... She's still alive. Hey, yo, cool, you jets, cats. Change your mind about sticking together? Follow me. She's alive. Just... I don't know. She's dead weight. Should have left her behind. Sorry, bro. That's not our style. We gotta look out for ourselves, man. You're wrong. We'll never survive unless we look out for each other. We'll figure out a way to help fire. End the trips. I promise. You sure you don't want some of our food, Stalker? It'll be a cold day before I need a couple of kids to survive in the wild. It just don't jive. What doesn't? Get with it, Dad. Monster drain slugs, then it drain people. It's a drag, see? Don't make no sense. He has a point. The same question has been taxing my ample brains. There's an old cave troll legend that people and slugs share the same energy. Deep down, a, a light you could call it. Magic from the earliest days. I never took much stock in it, but maybe that's why this creature's draining us now. Keen. So how do we beat it? Light. What? The monster is afraid of light. In the woods, I used a phosphorus slug and it fled. That's why it only attacks at night. You know, he's right. It did flee when he shot that slug. So, what do we got? All right. That's one phosphorus slug <coughs> and a flashlight with half a charge left. Uh, this somehow does not look promising. Well, it's a start. Tonight, we'll sleep in shifts and take turns on guard. Hey, E, it's your watch, buddy. Did you see any? <laughs> Looks like it's just you and me, buddy. Huh? You should be more careful. I almost slugged you. There is a great disturbance here, Eli Shane. Oh, so you noticed. Shadow and light must exist in balance, or all is threatened. Okay, thanks for that. Helpful, really. But I've got a thing, so... You fight in shadow. <gasps> you see your enemy, but do not understand. Then can you help me? What are we dealing with here? We have already shown you. The barrier between worlds is weakened. Deep in the bowels of this earth, the Dark Bane and their monsters wait for the time to rise up and take all of Slavterra. Their magic is weak here. It costs them to travel through the barrier. But they have ways of returning to physical form. That's why it's draining slugs? A slug's natural magic is protective. There are forces which can pervert this. This was the first. Good to know. Now let's go stop this thing. I told you not to set the barn on fire! Our enemy hates light! But therefore, he must also hate the fire! Ha. Ah! Yeah, but so do we! <laughs> it's getting toasty in here! <laughs> Eli! Gord! Behind you! Drag, baby.
to fight another day. Then you can help your friends. Jump! It won't stop now. It has our scent. Our scent? I know when I'm being hunted. Now help me with this boat. The river is the fastest way back to town. I don't know, Shane. It's not in our nature to trust the Shadow Clan. But if you say this thing is from the Deep Caverns, we need a plan. Hit it with the phosphorus slugs and try to hold out till dawn. Heck of a plan. I hope we can pull this off. She's putting a lot of faith in us. They all are. When are you gonna get it through your head? There is no us. You stay here with the slugs if you want. I'm gonna hunt that thing. Ah. Well, that's crazy. You won't last five seconds on your own. I don't back down. That thing drained my friends. They need us. This town needs us. You want to be a tough guy? Fine. But sometimes being tough means knowing how to ask for help. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now! Open fire! Stalker! You all right? Face it, Eli. This is hopeless. You can't fight what you can't touch. I have an idea. We're gonna give this thing exactly what it wants. Hey! This way, you big ugly monster! Sorry, guys, but you'll just have to trust me. Miss me! Try again! What is he doing? Okay! It's solid! You and me, ugly! It hates fire and it hates light, so let's give it both. Okay, Burpee, ready to go, Supernova? I hope this works. eating snack foods after midnight. They give me the craziest of nightmares. Town's oh. <laughs> back to normal. What happened to Stalker? 
I don't know. He left before daybreak, without his reward, too. You ask me? I think he didn't want the reminder he'd done something nice for people. You did a good thing, Eli. Yeah, maybe. Why do you sound worried? Something the Shadow Clan said. This was just the beginning. Slug Terra's magic is weakening. You really have to ask yourself, what's next? Come on, guys! We got a distress call, so hop on your mech's end! We still have no mecha beasts. It's been over two weeks. This better be worth the wait. Horde! All right, all right, I'm finished. <laughs> and now, may I present to you our new and improved mecha beasts? Huh? Hmm? Wow, they look exactly the same. Yeah, well, maybe on the outside. But wait till I demo what they can do. We're kind of in a hurry here. Can't you just tell us? Uh, no. A work of art like this deserves a proper debut. And man, it's gonna be awesome! You must be Coop. In the old days, I would have called your father. Been a while since then. But I figured you might know what to do. What seems to be the problem? Wandered into the cavern two days ago. Pretty beat up and disoriented when we found him. Found who? Him. Dr. Black? from the desert. No blaster, no mecha, nothing. That must be where the Shadow Clan sent him. He's been wandering for over two weeks. I can't believe it. We got him. Well, technically, we didn't. Ah, this is no time for technicalities. Epic poems will be written about the day Pronto had the most feared scoundrel in all of Slaterra. His mercy. <laughs> you have no authority to hold me. I'm the Shane, and you're gonna pay for your crimes. <laughs> I will give you one more chance to release me, or face the consequences. <laughs> I think you're forgetting who's got the upper hand here. <laughs> Am I? Huh? Floppers. <laughs> Should we go after him? It won't matter, Cord. He's probably already called for backup. Coop? I got no love for Dr. Black. Guy gives me the creeps. But I do love this cavern. If more of his men are on their way, it'll be war here. You've done your share, Coop. If a fight's coming, it's ours. Dr. Black can't stay here, Eli. We're gonna need to move him somewhere more secure. Uh, <laughs> yes, but how exactly? Surely we would all prefer he remain... In there, uh, behind those bars. Then maybe we'll take the bars, too. Ah, now this is good. Dr. Black, safely back there. And Pronto the Conqueror, safely up here. <laughs> Begin the journey to... Uh, wait, uh, uh, where are we taking him? Good question. Locking Black up could change everything. If he stays captured. Well, what about Stalagmite 17? I hear it's been reinforced since we took it back from Mr. Saturday. That prison should hold Black. If we can get him there. Then that's where we go. Hopefully we'll get there before that Black Guard can alert any... <laughs> Word travels fast. Indeed. <laughs> Oh, 
are awesome. Just wait till you see. Not to hurry up the big debut, but we're kind of getting hammered here. It'll be worth the wait. Trust me. <laughs> Pronto enjoys being overly dramatic, as much as anyone, but, uh, come on already, Cord! Not yet. We need more room. What? More room? Okay, so before you check out my super-duper upgrades, you're gonna want to wear one of these. Nice! All right, everyone, press your green buttons! Woo! We have green buttons? We have green buttons! Awesome! Hey, pretty haunted rides if I do say so myself. Come on, transform you hunk of junk! Sorry, we couldn't do that sooner. But we had to wait till we got to open ground. Are you kidding? We smoked them! Cord, you're a genius! It's because I heard Black had been recruiting top tech talent for some kind of super vehicle. So if I had to guess, that's... <laughs> it's called Titan. <laughs> and you're about to find out what it can do. I'll, I'll be, be taking, taking Dr. Black, Black now. Quentin! After all, a man like that deserves to ride in style. Last thing he invented almost crushed us. Looks like he's picking up where he left off. I 
would prefer to be rescued alive! Sorry, sir. Where'd you pick up those hunks of junk? Hey, watch your mouth! Don't listen to him, Wyatt. Nobody's ever had these kinds of mechas before. over the canyon, so, uh, rock on, Cord. And rock on to the Marinoid to outbox the Titan! <laughs> As they will write one day. <laughs> Amusing story. But Quentin had no intention of catching you. He was corralling you. Like cattle! Hit the brakes! <laughs> Quentin led us into an ambush! All right, you mean Cord will keep him busy so Pronto could get through with Black. Mike 17. Ah! The rest of us will keep him off you. Easy there, buddy. 
Time to hit the road! like you have to thank me or anything. Change the burpees velocimorph. Well, I'd say he's now a megamorph. Well, can we save the science lesson for later? We're trapped. No, we're not. <laughs> this is madness. We barely made it across Cobra Canyon last time, and this crossing is even longer. Trust me. <laughs> now, Cord! Bye-bye, Titan! <laughs> Did you see that? You should have run when you had the chance! <laughs> uh, dude, you're playing chicken with a titan! I'll take your mods over whatever Quentin created any day! <laughs> Check 
just need enough speed. <laughs> Delivered the mighty Dr. Black to justice. Feels weird. We got Black. <laughs> it's over. I hope. Dude, what else could happen? I mean, come on. None of his goons are gonna break him out of Stalagmite 17. <laughs> you have beaten those who serve me today. But trust me. You have no idea what's coming. You heard me right. My product is proven to make that untamable slug of yours a slinger's best friend. For those fortunate enough to obtain a quantity from this extremely limited supply, I guarantee the potency and efficacy 100% or my name isn't. Dr. Harlan E. Black. This is how you wheel them in, son. <clears throat> I feel obliged to warn you, there won't be enough for everyone. If you'll make an orderly line, my assistant Thaddeus will see to you. Give me two! I'll take three! <laughs> You kind sir will have to wait in line with everyone else. No, I'm not buying. I'm only wondering if my eyes are playing tricks on me. You see, I could swear you look exactly like the gentleman I denied permission to be here. You can't stand in the way of science. I have a valuable product, and people should be free to make up their own minds. Well, these people listen to me, my cavern, my rules. And what happens to people who break my rules? B -b -b bad things, Mr. Dare. <laughs> That's right. Bad things. Father, we should go. Listen here, you little coward. Your father never backs down. Never. Your sheep may not mind, but no one tells me what to do. No! No! What makes us who we are? Is it pain, suffering, triumph in the face of unbeatable odds, or is it something else? Pass me the blaster, you fool! In my case, a moment's hesitation revealed a much greater truth. What's the matter with you? Give me the blaster! Oh, surrender! <laughs> I surrender. Oh, you don't have to worry, doctor. I'm feeling generous today. I'll even allow you to leave with something. Your life. <laughs> Father! I said he'll leave with his life. Nothing else. Unless you have a problem with that? Father! No! Father! Father! Step foot in this cavern again and you will suffer! <laughs> Time you learned what real work is, son. Whoa! Take him to the mines! <laughs> no! The truth is, in this life, we only have ourselves.
And so it is here, on this great field of battle. A day that Slug Terra will long remember. The day we crushed our enemies and returned our leader to his rightful place. Now who's with me? <laughs> go ahead and soften him up for us. Then we'll go rescue Dr. Black ourselves. <laughs> and get the reward. How do you know there'll even be one? Dr. Black probably doesn't even know we're here to spring him. Dr. Black always rewards those loyal to him. Hear that? Rewards. So go on, show them what you got. <laughs> and we'll get a sneak peek at their defenses. <laughs> Into the breach for victory! <laughs> Dr. Black, hand him over, or there will be consequences. We'll take the consequences. And stay out! We're lucky they're too greedy to work together. Stalagmite 17 may be nearly impossible to break out of, but it's not completely impervious to someone breaking in. Never you worry. There is nothing they can throw at us that Pronto and his merry band of heroes can't stop. We got things covered here, Eli. Better get back to your post. Fine. Uh, call me if you need me. Let me guess. Some of my associates are outside, attempting to rescue me? They're wasting their time. <laughs> Loyal to a fault. Usually when we meet, you're running away from my ghouls. Now we have a chance to talk. Face to face. I'll pass. Oh, come now. You mean to tell me you have nothing to ask me? Now that you mention it? Yeah. You could be anything you want. Why be evil? Why not use your power for good? <laughs> not everyone can be the hero, Eli. And if you want to know the answer to that question, to understand who I am. We need to go back to where it all started. Slag Rock Cavern. In its day, you'd never find a more wretched place. We had our own brand of justice here. Only the strong survived. And if you were quick and clever, you'd do even better. Lording over it all, the gangster, Vigo Dare. <laughs> I learned quickly how to take care of myself in more ways than one. To get ahead, you had to be a good slug slinger. And even as a young man, I was very good. Yeah, it's him, boss. Relax, kid. You think I care about a watch? Huh. You're working for me now. Any questions? What happens if I say no? <laughs> we got a comedian here, boys. He only picks the best, you know. I don't take orders from anyone. You'll get used to it. I did. You don't want to cross him. And so I began my employment for Vigo Dare, the same man that ran my worthless father out of town and pressed me into servitude. It wasn't entirely unpleasant. For the first time in my life, I never wanted for anything, materially speaking. I learned the ways of commerce and how fear can be a tremendous motivator. In no time, I had more than proven my worth. I also learned a valuable lesson. No matter how loyal you are, no matter how hard you work, you're always expendable. Best move yourself, Jim O'Shane. You're one of Vigo's boys. A long way from Slag Rock, aren't ya? My mistake wasn't challenging a shame. It was thinking that if I held my ground, it would show my loyalty. Six months, and not a word. I was, as you put it, left to rot. And upon my return... I lost an entire shipment because of you! Stop! 
step foot in this cavern again, and you will suffer. I had heard those words before. It was the best thing that could have happened to me. It set me on a journey that would end where I am today. Back in jail? I learned something from that two-bit gangster. Power is everything. To have power, you must be feared. And the best way for me to be feared was to become a better slug slinger than anyone else. For years, I trained in secret, preparing myself for a reawakening. Only one person would stand in the way of that. Your father. Sorry, guys. We didn't sign up for a job like this. Give up, Shane Gang. You're all that's left. That's a big negative. The cavalry just arrived. <laughs> Security slingers? They're just a bunch of mall cops. Retreat! And run away! Are we glad to see you? Yeah, you can always count on us security slingers. Whether it's a mall or a movie house, the playground or the pool. Well, now that includes prisons. Booyah! Slugs are power. The more you have, the stronger you are. But you have to know how to use them. How to bend them to your will. I would duel anyone who would accept my challenge. And many who did not. I did lose, but increasingly less. Then, one day, the stranger walked out of the mist. The unbeatable master. I know how this part of the story goes. She told me herself. Surely you know there are two sides to every story, Eli. Both of us worthy, but she could only pick one. Evil is in your heart, Thaddeus Black. There is no place for that in a slug slinger. Forgive me, Thaddeus. I don't need you. I don't need anyone. I am going to be the best. And I will not be stopped! This one will be great trouble for you, Will Shane. What's your business here, mister? Payback. Well, well. The comedian returns. Still got my watch? I surrender, I surrender! This cavern belongs to me now. Anyone still loyal to Vigo Dare will leave with him or suffer the same humiliation. Those of you willing to pledge loyalty to me will be rewarded. Huh. They'll be back working for me within a month. So, you beat Vigo, captured his cavern, made yourself rich? You had everything you wanted. Why did you need to create ghouls? Not yet. Not even close. My forces were growing, and so was my ambition. I took a broken down cart line and turned it into the backbone of commerce in Slug Terror. 
Many were more than willing to provide me the rights of way I needed. Others needed more convincing. Jim O'Shane had grown old and weak. He was of little consequence until there was a changing of the guard. The new Shane was more of a complication. It has to stop, Black. The intimidation, the dirty dueling, the stealing and cheating. <laughs> You're in no position to dictate terms to me, Will Shane. Worthless runt. You don't have to do this, you know. Perhaps I didn't make myself clear. Wasn't talking to you. It's okay. You'll be safe with me. <laughs> You'll never be a slug slinger, Thaddeus. No slug will ever willingly work with you again. <laughs> then I'll find another way. Something better. And then, Will Shane, you will know what it's like to lose everything. <laughs> For years I studied, analyzed, tested, and retested. I knew everything there was to know about slugs except how to make them loyal to me. And then I found something interesting. The ancient text spoke of the primal forces that made the slugs, about good and evil, and of darker forces beneath us, waiting to be unleashed. And then I found it, the wellspring of Guling, dark water. But I would need more than what little seeped through the cracks, <laughs> much more. I began a series of dark water experiments. Through trial and error, I knew I was onto something never before seen. Then it happened. A portal to the deep caverns opened, and I was pulled in. The effects of this trip would wreak havoc on my body. But it was well worth it. You have something I need. The Dark Bane supplied me with dark water, and in exchange, I agreed to allow one of them to disguise itself and return with me. You know how dangerous dark water is, and the Dark Bane? I've met them. They want to conquer Slug Terra, and then. <laughs> <laughs> they may be strong, but the Dark Bane are backwards and naive. They'll agree to anything when the hint of escape is dangled in front of them. You're being played, Black. <laughs> we'll see. Once I had the dark water, it was a matter of trial and error. Success was mine. My first test subject was obvious. Huh? What's happened to you? You look like a ghost. <laughs> Funny you should mention that. Is that a slug? Black, what have you done to it? <laughs> I fixed it. Made it better. Good enough to finally beat you. The power I could never imagine! Corrupting slugs! You can destroy all slug terror! Black! Stop this! Black! Black! It took me some time to perfect the ghouls, but the rest, as they say, is history. No! What happened to my father? You're the only one who knows! Where did he go? <laughs> You're beyond twisted, you know that? You tell me everything, everything except the one thing I need to know most! <laughs> Perhaps you might consider sharing a few stories of your own in exchange. The Shanes do have a few secrets. This so-called burning world, for example? Forget it. The Shane's secrets are gonna stay that way. Hmm. Pity. That's the last of them citizens. Eli, 
It's over. <laughs> Sorry to break it to you, but your lackeys plan to bust you out tanked. <laughs> uh, they mean well. But this situation calls for a somewhat uh, different approach. And only one of my associates is prepared for that. Expecting some new associates. Ah, they seem to be arriving now. Huh? <laughs> I have only begun to unleash my power on Slug Terror. The shames will soon be no more. Slug Terror will be mine, and there is nothing you can do to stop it. No! I enjoyed our little chat. That terror portal worked, but we're lucky that only four Dark Bane came through. And with Nacho, that makes five here in Slug Terra. We have to make sure Black doesn't try it again. After all you did to hold back his minions, I'm just sorry I let him get away. It's not your fault, Eli. We'll go after Dr. Black again. We'll find another way to hold him. No. Dr. Black is not a man that can ever be jailed. He'll have to meet his fate another way. For now, we've got a bigger battle to fight. We're gonna need all the help we can get. We need to get ready, and we need to spread the word. Well, what are we waiting for? To victory! Unless we 
take out that pillbox kid. We're gonna be buried in this trench. Permanently. Burpee, Jules, it's double barrel time. <laughs> Did I miss anything? Just barely. <laughs> okay, we did it. But I'm willing to bet that was the easy part. here black guards moved in a few weeks ago built that beachhead and took the town overwhelming forces led by someone or something I've never seen before and I've seen plenty we've been trying to fight back but most of the caverns native slugs have been captured and taken to a stronghold in the center of the island black guards are turning them into ghouls All of our attempts to stop them have failed. Without slug energy, this cavern will die. We need to get to that stronghold and bust those slugs out. Fast. I wish it was that easy. First, you'll have to get past this blockade on the road out of town. No sweat. Well, this roadblock makes what you just fought look like a walk on the beach. And it's the only way to the stronghold. But once we get past the blockade, it looks like there's a back way to the stronghold. Here, through this jungle. If we sneak up that way, we might be able to free the slugs without firing a shot. Yeah, but if we do have to fire a shot, we're gonna need every slug we've got. And then some. Then take my slug. Thanks. What's his name? Who names their slugs? I do. Cool. I'll call you... Rookie. What's he do? Beats me. I don't have a blaster. Never seen him hit velocity. Well, we'll find out soon enough. See what you can do with him, Burpee. I'll assemble a group. Our resistance isn't what it was, but I've still got some strong slingers still standing. Thanks. But you and your two need to stay here to keep this side of the island protected. Well, they certainly won't mind the rest. Are you sure? Positive. Meet us at the blockade after we have it secured.
Buckle up, guys. We're going live. Work, Shane. We'll set a post here to protect your backside. Good luck. Thanks. Okay, Shane Gang, if we're gonna take this stronghold by surprise, we have to leave now. He is tantalizingly near. <laughs> Quietly, Cape Troll. Much as I long for combat, stealth has become our greatest weapon. Requirement for silence. Go 
get spinner. <laughs> I gotta put that in the prank library. So much for sneaking in quietly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that everyone in the place is aiming a weapon at us. Well, if it isn't everyone, it might as well be. Look, it's a dark vein. Our cover has been blown, we are vastly outnumbered, and the gigantic dark thing from the pits of the deep caverns is spanning the largest gather I have ever seen. And they think they have a chance against Frosto? <laughs> I've seen these ones before. Step up the cooling process. I want the last of these slugs turned now! I felt it too, Burpee. Those guys are ghouling slugs like there's no tomorrow. We gotta find a way through those walls. My blaster needs more time before I can use the double barrel again. What about a Megamorph? Sure, but how do I get it up to speed? I guess we'll just have to work with what we have. Ready, Burpee? <laughs> You burpee, but we're getting hammered here. You just want me to shoot you at the wall? Okay, burpee, do what you gotta do. Get that infernus and ghoul him. Well, we've got to take this hill and free those slugs. Burpee risked everything for this cavern. All he'd ask is that we do the same, and we're not going to let him down. So let's save Burpee and the rest of those slugs. Rookie, are you sure? In that case, guess there's no time like the present to see what you can do. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
The cooling machine is nearby. Follow me. <laughs> By follow me, I of course mean after you. I don't care in what order I shoot you. I have enough ghouls for everyone. Hit him high, Cord. <laughs> I can't hit him at all! No, but you distracted him! <laughs> <laughs> Little shame! If you're the best this world has to offer, <gasps> Slug Terra is doomed! Looks like you're a full-fledged member of my bandolier of brothers. The cavern is brightening. Given time, it will heal. Looks like another win for the Shane Gang. No, it isn't. Distress calls, Eli. Multiples. Black is on the move. It wasn't just this cavern. He's taking all of Slug Terra! Well, he's in for a fight. We'll confront him and the Dark Bane head on, like we've just done, and show that his ghouling Terra is no match for the Shane Gang. Slug Terra will not fall. We always thought that Slug Terra would stay the same forever beautiful, peaceful, a world full of magic and hope. But that all changed. <laughs> Dr. Black changed it for us. Wow. He made his plans in secret. Drilling into a forbidden world to bring evil into ours. And when a well ran dry, he found another. It was all he needed to make himself an army. Yes, an army of ghouls. And he didn't stop there. Dr. Black invented technology most of us only see in nightmares. And he's using it against anyone who gets in his way. There isn't a jail in Slug Terror that can hold him. Because now, he has Darkbane working for him. Right here, right now. No! Slug Terror will be mine. And there is nothing you can do to stop it. The Dark Bane are not a legend. These things will do anything to find a way up to Slug Terra, even if it means an allegiance with Dr. Black. That is what we're up against. That is why we need your help. Not just here, but in all the other caverns Black has taken over. <laughs> We're 
all singers and dancers. Those Darkbane were no match for them. I'm sorry, but you're on your own. Well, so much for the rousing speech. Let's do this. <laughs> Slugs you can. That's why you're here. Trix, check it out. Ugh, that's a lot of guards. Perfect. <laughs> do you think we, uh... Yeah, you wanna do it? Well, that is your slug. Fine. <laughs> you got your drop zones, rookie? I have a feeling we're in for a bad surprise. are doing the same thing Burpee did on our way to Stalagmite 17. If they're using Megamorphs, there's no way we can compete. <laughs> At least not until we get some upgrades of our own. Well, in the meantime, I've got this. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> choice. <gasps> I thought everyone had evacuated. We need to get these people to safety. How? As long as they have these amped up megamorph ghouls, we can't touch them. 
Well, it's a good thing we've got a Megamorph, too. Dude, if you're thinking what I think you're thinking, it's a no-go. These streets are too short for you to get up to that kind of speed. Then I'll just have to go up. captured a lot of slugs, but at least the people got out safely. But we got our tails handed to us. Until we're evenly matched, we don't stand a chance. Somehow we've got to get the rest of our slugs to do what you can do, buddy. Without jumping off buildings? Well, it worked, didn't it? Really? Aww. As near as I can tell, the key is speed. Get a slug or ghoul going fast enough, and they'll have even more power when they transform. But they weren't using just any ghouls. You saw those things. I wouldn't be surprised if they were Black's top ghouls. That might explain why Burpee can do it. He can't find another slug with as much experience as him. Well, I can only help you with the first part, the speed. And maybe not even. I boosted this blaster's power core, which wasn't much of a challenge for a skilled troll like yours truly. However... <laughs> blasters aren't built to withstand that kind of energy. Can't you tweak the blasters to make them stronger? I wish. That's way out of my league, bro. And you know what that means. We're paying another visit to Red Hook. And almost all the paths to reach him take us through caverns now controlled by Dr. Black. What? <laughs> Forget your maps! You have drunk! Hey! I shall lead us there in safety and style! You see? Safe passage as promised. Hmm. Does Quiet Lawn Cavern seem quieter than usual? Where is everyone? Come on. Hopefully Red Hook knows. If the old grouch is even here. Oh, great. There he is. Well, if it isn't the same, gang. So great to see you. To what do I owe the pleasure? Oh, the pleasure? I hate to admit it, but I need some more of your master slinger smithing. I was trying to amp up our blaster power cores, but right... Where is everyone, Red Hook? What do you mean? He means it seems like this town is empty. Oh, that... Why don't you guys come in for a spot of lemonade, and I'll tell you all about it. That sounds fantastic! Pronto is quite parched, but I hope your lemonade is not too sweet. <laughs> Pronto likes it to have some... pucker. Uh -huh. Are we not having lemonade? No. Hospitality's never really been a Red Hook thing. <laughs> Perhaps I should have done a bit more research into my character. Twist! You got me. So maybe you avoided our little trap, but good luck avoiding them. Here so easily. <laughs> this was all a setup. <laughs> Sorry, Pronto. Well, I refuse to accept your highly probable scenario. I prefer self delusion. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, that explains where the Dark Bane got those accelerators for their blasters. Dr. Black must have Red Hook at his citadel. Does that mean you are going to want Proto to take you there next? Our only chance of defeating these guys is to get Red Hook back. That has to be our mission, Eli, no matter what. We gotta get out of here first. <laughs> Chance, guys, you gotta run. <laughs> Go! Get out of here! <laughs> Don't worry about me. Go! <laughs> Looks like you got me. You're either a hero or a fool. There's probably some truth to both. I can vouch for that. What's your game, Shane? Just helping my friends, but. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? <laughs> nice knowing you, Eli. Let's go! Whoa! Dr. Black will be here shortly to decide what to do with you. Tell him not to take too long. If I get bored, I might leave. I know you think you're a tough slinger, Shane, but all you are right now is a prisoner without your slugs and blaster. A nice one. It will be useful to one of my Dark Bane brothers after some modification. <laughs> Which way do you think we should... What is it, buddy? Okay, okay, shh. We'll go check it out. Sense bad slug energy here. <sighs> I knew Black was making tons of ghouls, but this is insane. <laughs> What is he doing? 
doing with those ghouls? We have the Shane. Well done. He will suffer soon enough. Right now, however, we need more ghouls. See to it! I want to know what that machine does, but we need to find Red Hook and get him to safety first. A room under guard. This looks promising. I'll finish this a lot quicker than you quick. <clears throat> You're alive. Um, why wouldn't I be? Uh, figured when that big oaf brought me this, you were toast. You already put the upgrade on it? Oh, this is gonna be easier than I thought. All we need to do is fire Burpee at the wall and... Ow! Are you nuts? I still have to fine-tune the core capacity. No telling what'll happen if you fire that thing now. Something in common, you and I. Breaking out of prison cells. When you said my blaster isn't ready, how unready are we talking? Eh? We can't live forever, kid. Fire it up! Yes, it works. We really should go. I'd want to hold on a little tighter this time. Took you so long. Did a little sightseeing. Let's go. <clears throat> we have the Shane. How precisely do we have him? We'll go after them. No, you needn't bother. With one more shipment of slugs, we'll have enough ghoul power to tear Slug Terra apart. Get to work. Thanks for coming for us, but how'd you know I'd be here? Eli Shane always follows his hero instinct. Usually to do something heroically foolish. Is that what everyone thinks about me? Uh-huh. That's you? I don't know. Pretty much, huh? Well, all that matters is that Red Hook's safe, and we've got his accelerators. Now, we just need to figure out the slug part. We'll head back to HQ and regroup. We'll be back in action in no time. Good. Because as soon as we can match slugs against the Dark Bane, we're coming right back here. Dr. Black has something planned, something big. And I have the feeling we're the only ones who can stop it.
As long as these ghouls keep spinning, the only thing keeping my army from me is dirt and stone. Ours. We will show Slug Terra something even more beautiful. Our fury. Red Hook added. It's not hmm? just the blaster upgrade. <laughs> Stunts can't do it, even with the accelerator. The added speed just throws them off. Sorry, little guy. It's like some slugs are ready for it and some aren't. So how do we find out which of us slugs are ready? Line up for roll call. Burpee, banger, stunts, rocky, buzzsaw, chiller, jewels, spinner, suds, spooker, glimmer, beaker, bolo, goober, tangles, digger, mo, burner, larry, mucky, sparky, rookie. Okay, so here's the deal. Burpee, banger, chiller, jewels, spinner. Looks like you're my slugs who can handle the accelerator and megamorph. So I'm gonna be counting on you five today. A lot. Buzzsaw, Bolo, and the rest of you? Don't worry. I know you'll all get there. <laughs> Bolo, Buzzsaw, wait! Just because you can't Megamorph doesn't mean you're not two of my best slugs. Your time will come. I know it. So, only the best slugs can do it, eh? Ah, then, I can assure you, Stinky will join the ranks. You flatulorinkus. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, stinky! I always knew you had it in you! I stand corrected! Now we know where we stand against Black. I just hope my theory's right. Otherwise, we're heading into a hornet's nest for no good reason. All those ghouls in one place? From how you describe that machine, it can only have one purpose, Eli. He's punching through to the deep caverns. We fought an army of Dark Bane once already. I, for one, don't plan on doing it again. Uh, yes, yes, it is all very nice. But charging straight into Black's impenetrable stronghold is many things. Brave, foolhardy, insane, but smart! It is not. You know, I'm glad to hear you feel that way, Pronto. Because I've got a different mission in mind for you. Uh, are you sure I could not just come with you? Good luck, Pronto. <gasps> yes, I am going to lead it. 
Let's pick up the pace, people! Don't know how long we have until Black breaks through. We can't let anything slow us down. Then I'm guessing that's gonna be a problem. No problem at all. Just remember the cooldown. Our blasters can't handle rapid fire megamorphs. <laughs> Scratching, scraping. They're almost here. So are the Shane Gang. They're headed this way with some serious firepower. I'm sure we can keep them occupied until your brothers arrive. Can't we? <laughs> of course, it is clear why Eli chose Pronto for this most dangerous mission. Pronto is brave, extremely <sighs> intelligent. The only thing I cannot quite figure out is... Why did Proto accept? Geronimo! You sure about this, Eli? Nope. You? Nope. Then let's do it! This can be just you and me, Black! No one else has to get hurt! Oh, it will be you and me. But I assure you, your friends will suffer as well. No! Furnace hadn't shown me the way. I would never have seen how to upgrade my ghouls. Ah, huh? So you could use them to destroy your own home? Oh, floppers. I've outgrown this citadel. Emperor deserves a grander palace. Don't you think? <laughs> I'm talking about Slug Terra. What do you think the Dark Bane are gonna do when they all get here? Sit around and play slug ball? They will do as I command. They are but a means to an end. Yeah, the end of us all. No, not all of us. 
but certainly you. Look at that. Red Hook said no more accelerators were made. Pity for you, he was lying. <laughs> Shadow Clan still gathered at the Guardian Gate. Then there will be nothing to stop us from surging through this entrance to Slot Terra. We have waited a millennium, brothers. In minutes, we will have Slot Terra! a dozen times, and you might just be better than him, but not good enough. You have no idea how good I am. You wouldn't have lasted this long if we were in the deep caverns. Well, we're not. But if that's where you're from, I'd be happy to send you back. Make you powerful? You're just as pathetic as the other slot tearing scum. Whoa! <laughs> you know, for someone who hates slug Terrans, you sure do seem to love taking orders from Dr. Black. <laughs> you think we serve Black? Perhaps for the moment. But soon, when the rest of my brothers emerge, things will be very different for everyone. <laughs> oh, floppers. to fear the wrath of Pronto the Magnificent! It seems we were guarding the wrong passage, but thanks to the Molinoid, we can now correct that error. Uh, I don't know what you just said, but man, I'm sure glad you're here. Yes, yes! No need to thank me for saving you and all of Slug Terra. I am Pronto! It's what I do. And yet I feel like I'm forgetting something. Come on, we gotta help Eli. Let me see. I ate a healthy breakfast, saved the world. What was I supposed to do? Bolo, I told you you were two of my best slugs. 
I'm just glad going double barrel worked. Worked. <laughs> uh, you took your best shot and failed. Slug Terra is about to fall. Look! Into the Terra portal! Attack! Attack! We're why? <laughs> You're too late. I've already won. I wasn't expecting you. I just keep coming! I don't think we can stop them! Look what you've done! You're gonna destroy all of Slug Terra! Yourself. What's the problem, Cord? He was shutting down the machine while you were still in there. Forgive me, son of Shane. My actions were for the good of all of Slug Terra. I know. You were just doing what needed to be done. The barrier has been renewed, and without the ghouls, it will not be broken again. So it's over. The Dark Bane? Black? They're gone. Yes. Thanks to you and your friends, Son of Shane. Come on, bro. You really going back up to the surface? Don't be so emotional, Cord. Of course he is, now that he's learned to ride his Infernus. That is why we have come to the drop. 
You ready? And there's nothing else we can say to change your mind? I appreciate everything you guys said on the way over here. But I know what I have to do. So this is it. This is... goodbye. You didn't expect me to leave a big giant tunnel up to the surface where anyone could find it, did you? You're staying! <laughs> I knew it! I can't believe you did that to me! Come here! Hey, you guys are right. Slug Terra still needs a Shane. This is my home, and you guys are my family. I'm not going anywhere. But, um, maybe we should hold off on the hug fest. As I've always said, slugs before hogs. Yeah! <laughs>